Success in road cycling is dependent on a number of factors, and while technical setup is crucial to good results, first you must trust the team you're working with. When you are racing, we're obviously in a very tight unit, and a lot of the time you do have to put a lot of trust into your fellow riders because a lot of the time we can't actually see what's going up. If you're in the middle of the peloton, your vision is pretty limited, especially when it's raining. You know, you've got to trust the guys in front of you or if it's in crosswinds and everybody's in a line, everyone's trying to get out of the wind, but you're in that last inch of road, you can't see what's coming and you're just hoping that they're doing what they need to be doing and they don't crash because if they crash in front of you, then you've got nowhere to go. So having that trust in your colleagues and stuff, it, it's really important. The team work hard to make sure each rider has the perfect bike setup for their riding style and physique, working closely with mechanics to maximize performance. It's really important for the rider to have their say. I think the bike is your tool, and we're going down descents at 100k an hour plus at times. We're going over cobblestones, tight corners, slippy corners, especially in the rain. So it's all different. If we all rode the same tire pressure, one person might not like that tire pressure. So there's a lot of people that have different preferences. In the bike setup, of course, I have like a bigger bike. For that reason, I'm taking more uh, more wind uh, in the peloton. I always try like to have an aerodynamic position. So maybe my uh, my back is more flat than uh, than the other riders. I think so. But I think like uh, the height is like uh, it's okay. I'm taller than the others, but uh, because of my extra centimeters, I have more weight. And for the climbs, uh, that can uh, sometimes be, be hard. So I would say it's more more about uh, my extra kilos than. Uh, and my extra hit. Yeah. Some guys can just get on the bike and ride, whether it's the saddle's a little bit different or whatever, whereas I'm a really, I'm sensitive to position change, so even if my saddle's been changed by a mill or something, I can kind of feel it, so I probably uh, speak to the mechanics a little bit more and always check in and making sure that everything's good. And I think they appreciate that, they know that they're doing their job properly and they have the trust, or they've got my trust, and vice versa, you know, it's important uh, relationships I have. This is the top rider, and for me, for the team, the 70 is the most important for, for all. The brake is very important. The glue for the tire is important. The position of the rider is important. This is very, very important for all. We work like with guys that uh, specialize in uh, bike uh, fittings, but usually you do that in the start of the season, and then you have like one bike setup, and uh, you say like to the mechanics, I want the bike like uh, that and that. Usually like for the whole uh, season, it's, it's the same, so you don't change that much. Okay, if you have like a small problem, you say like the mechanic, uh, could you please lower or more higher the saddle, but it's not so big differences during the season.